Hey, I think this time I have it. This is Carol, and this is what I'm going to be teaching at the Creative, it's called the Creative Painting Convention in Las Vegas. It's February 20th through the 25th. So you can call them on the internet, Creative Painting Convention, Las Vegas. Uh, this is a Sunday from 2 to 9 acrylic painting. So I wanted to show you how I put my canvases on. You can see, look at all these canvases that I have my patterns on. So I should have like 30 students. So I have tape. This is masking tape. And you tape across the whole top. All the way across the top and around each side. So you go around each side, each side. That way, you can lift up your paper of your pattern. I have my pattern all made up. And you can lift up your pattern and put your graphite paper. Now this is black graphite paper. Here, this is black graphite paper. And you look at it to see which is the darkest side. So is it shiny side? No, you want the darker side. So I slide that underneath my picture. You can see the black. I have to move it around. I don't like a big, big piece. I like to be able to move this around. So then I have a nice sharp pencil. I like to put my pencils in a cup. They're all nice and sharp. So I have quite a few because I like to have the sharp pencil so that I can do my drawing. Also, an ink pen will work. Uh, some people like stylus, but I just don't think they they do good on this. So then I just take my pencil. You can see it's been here many times. And this is how I put it on. And then I check it. See, I can check it and see where I'm at. So that's how I'm putting all my patterns on my canvases. So you can see that I got a lot more to do. I got all these down here to do yet. And I have masking tape, graphite paper, pencils, and I'm ready to go. My pattern and my canvases. So hopefully some of you will want to sign up. Come join us. I also have a watercolor that I'm doing on Tuesday. So one thing I'm giving everybody is this, this sheet that I got from Buck Paulson. And it is called Seascape Glossary of Terms for Seascapes. So this will go in everybody's packet. And I think this is wonderful for seascape artists to have this little draft of how the ocean goes. So I have a nice little... I make myself, when I, do a, um, when I do a class, I have a nice little, um, make myself a nice little notebook. Okay, that's it for today. Goodbye.